Hey, New Hope family, Pastor August here. We are on day five of our prayer and fasting as we lead into Spiritual Emphasis Week, Fresh Wind. We are so excited for what God is going to do. Um, So that's why we're preparing our hearts because we know God is going to move and he's going to move in mighty ways and we want to be ready for that. We want to be ready for what he wants to do in us and through us and and in our church family. And so today uh, we're going to pray specifically for prodigals. We're going to pray for people who have had relationships with Jesus and have walked away from them. People in our lives. Uh, Some of you may have children. Some of you may have brothers or sisters or moms or dads or, or spouses even or friends that you know. Uh, have walked away from their relationship with Jesus. And I want to read to you a passage in the Bible. This is 1 Timothy chapter 2, verses 1 through 4. It says this, uh, I urge you, first of all, to pray for all people. Ask God to help them, intercede on their behalf, and give thanks for them. Pray this way for kings and all who are in authority so that we can live peaceful and quiet lives marked by godliness and dignity. This is good and pleases God our Savior, who wants everyone to be saved and understand the truth. Recognize that our God wants everyone to be a part of his family. He wants everyone to be saved. He wants everyone to know the truth. And so we who already know the truth, we pray in intercession and believe for them and believe on their behalf. So there's two things that uh, I believe we should pray for today as we lead in uh, to Spiritual Emphasis Week, to Fresh Wind, uh, and, and and ask God to use us. So here's, here's what we're going to pray for. Number one, uh, let's pray for any prodigals that we know personally, people uh, who have walked away from the, the faith, people who have walked away from the family. And two, let's pray that God uses us to shine His light, to be an open door back into the family and the kingdom of God. And let's pray for opportunities to invite those uh, who need to hear the gospel message, that need to hear about the love of Jesus, that need to come back to the family. Let's pray for opportunities to invite those people to Freshland, to these special services that we're going to have coming up in just a few days. Would you pray with me right now? Dear God, we lift up every person in our lives and every person that we know who has had a relationship with you and has walked away from it. God, we ask that you would begin to soften their hearts. We stand in intercession right now for those people, God. We ask that you would begin to soften their hearts, open up their eyes, open up their ears, open up their lives to your message, to your truth, and to your love. And God, we pray that you would open up doors of opportunity for us to be able to invite those people into uh, the kingdom of God, into the family of God, and even invite them to fresh wind in just a few days, God. I pray that you would begin to open doors of opportunity for all of us to begin to have those conversations to invite people to what you are doing. Lord, we love you. We praise you. We can't wait to see what you do in this coming week. Lord, we praise you. It's in Jesus' mighty and holy name we pray. Amen.